My story is about moving from Macquarie Fields to Eds about six months ago. I had been private renting, but at the beginning of last year, things changed. I had to move because of some financial problems and I had a heart bypass operation. So it was quite a dramatic time. I ended up homeless for most of last year, staying with friends while I waited for my request for priority housing to be approved. Eventually this happened at the end of last year. The place I was offered was a one bedroom unit in a seniors complex. It was quite small, but after living with other people for a year, I was happy to take it. It seemed like a chance to make a new start, which was a great relief. I already had some contact with Ed's, including doing some projects in the area, like the men's shed. When I was staying with a friend in Lumia, I used to cycle over to the shed, so that gave me a sense of connection. The men's shed has been an important part of my time in Ed's because it gives me something to do and it's something people know me for. At first I felt a bit awkward, not knowing anybody. But gradually I got to know people, and now I feel part of it and try to welcome new members. I guess because I still remember what it was like to be new myself. I started a small garden there from which we have harvested some salad veggies when we have a barbecue. Now we've got funds to establish a large garden in a block of land next door. Our plans include selling plants to raise funds for the shed and giving some food away to people who need it. This reflects the philosophy of men's sheds to be part of the community. From this I've started another community garden project with the multicultural group at Ayrds High School and also at my seniors complex. It's a good way to bring people together. I find that Ayrds is a very active place, which is very stimulating. But now my 15 year old granddaughter has moved back to live with me, so that's quite a challenge, and it means I'll have to move again. I'll probably have to leave Ayrds, but it's been a valuable experience, and I've learnt that when you think things are settled, there may be something unexpected waiting around the corner. But we can learn to adapt, which is important in life.